Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe and turn on your post notifications. If you're a new mom or just a mom in general, subscribe to me because I would love to see some of y'all's videos. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything that we have for baby so far. This is things that I bought or things that John bought or just friends or family bought. These are literally just things that was axed off my registry. There is a few things left on my registry. Um, if I don't get, I'm gonna just go ahead and buy it myself. Also, quick note, um, the sun keeps going in and out. Keep seeing light changing, that's why. I kind of just put everything into some categories. I have a good bit of clothes already. I'm gonna just sit there and show every bit of his clothing because I think that would just take forever. These are probably my two favorite things that he owns. So there's this really cute, <laughs> this is really cute bear um, cardigan and it's so cute. Oh my goodness. Um, his godfather got this for him. Um, I was actually going to get this and he went, went ahead and got it for me so I didn't have to buy it. Um, but this is it's this really cute overall. Like, oh my goodness, y'all. It's so cute. Um, this is from uh, Simple Folk. Um, and it's just really cute. It's a little bit bigger. I think this one's a 3 to 6, I think. Uh, yeah, this is a 3 to 6. Um, it isn't on purpose because we want him to be a little bit filled out more to wear this. So, this is cute. So, this is technically like sleep stuff. Um, so obviously in behind me, uh, the crib is there. I'm still waiting for the mattress to come in. This is it. this is pretty much why I haven't filmed um, or posted um, the nursery tour yet. It's because there's still things that I'm waiting to come in. Ton of swaddles so far, but, but I've heard that it's always good to have swaddles, no matter how many. I want to say this was given by one of John's workers. I think so. Had this in a little gift box with some diapers and wipes and they're like super super cute and they're like really soft like the muslin ones and then I uh had gotten these two um very cute and then these two so I had all of those swaddles favorite swaddle this is like the one that I put like must have on my uh, registry is this one right here because it's just a cute rust color um I love this one. Like, I really think I'm gonna have them have him wrapped in this um, for a really cute photo for announcing his arrival and his name because everyone doesn't know his name yet. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is like really really cute. I take the taking care of babies sleep class, and she recommended um, to have a either like a zip up swaddle or a velcro one, um, and one of them that. A lot of people talked about was the Ollie swaddle because it's like super super easy to have them swaddled in, and that's this right here. It is a Velcro one. See, it's just like it Velcros. Um, but she recommended this because of the fact that like they can't get out of it, um, so it's more on the safer side to have a Velcro one. Um, while they're sleeping because if they happen to move their hands up or something like that if in a regular swaddle like the muslin ones I have right here um, It can potentially become a hazard and could get on their face and get smothered So something I learned so you can always have the olives the ollie swaddle or like a zip up one and then you can like put like a cute one over and Yeah, that's like all the swaddles that I have right now and I still have a few on registry actually that I want to get that's like in different some other colors that I want to get. <laughs> Having maybe just in a little bean burrito. Cute. <laughs> I do have the Hatch um, sound machine. So um, that's another thing that I learned. You would think that a baby would should be like in the most quiet room ever. Um, no noise, nothing, um, but um, they actually recommend you have a sound machine and that it's kind of like a little bit noisy in the room while they're sleeping because when they're in the womb, their blood flow um, is actually super, super loud um, and they get used to that. That's what this is. They're, um, 
there's the white noise on here and like some other sounds um and then like there's a night light too as well and then it's all controlled from your phone so i thought that was like really cool a baby humidifier well <laughs> also have a humidifier i felt like i mean come on with everything going on in the world right now the pandemic you know just just anything like just in general you know newborns they get sick very fast they don't have a very strong immune system like an adult and i felt like this would be really nice to have in the room to just keep the air clean so i'm really glad i got that so this is not really like a sleep thing it's something that's going to be used for when he's sleeping so i guess technically is like i don't know but um so i got the lollipop lollipop <laughs> i got the lollipop baby um camera baby monitor thing um and john's mom actually got this for us um this is also on the registry that i really wanted um it just looks like this right here and what's cool about it um obviously it's like also attached to your phone it's also like a smart camera like you can have look at it on your phone but i thought this was really cool you can like bend it bend it however you want it this is going to be on the bassinet first and then when he transitions to the crib then this is going to go on the crib not necessarily like they don't recommend you having them like full on sleeping in here like probably just like for naps but i don't even know if you can see it but this is the snuggle me organic um it's just a it's just like a little uh lounger um i think it's because like everyone was talking about the docket tot and i was just like no docket tot's like way too pricey for me but it literally has like the sides here so they don't like roll out but you could actually use this for tummy time too um, just like it's just it's just literally just a little lounger it's not meant to go in the crib it's not meant to go in the bassinet for them to sleep in like it's literally just for them to just kind of lounge in um so yeah, I really like this. I'm so glad I got this. I was, I put it on my registry and I was like, I don't know. Gage came through and got it for me. So thank you again, Gage, for that. Camera battery is dying. I wonder if I can get through this. Probably not. So the next category that I have is bath. Um, so the first thing I have is this kind of like bath support like tub thing and um you just kind of just put it in your tub and there's like holes in it so like when you're washing him like the water just goes um through them and it's very nice and it's very small too so it's like not like big and bulky um rinser thing it's a um it's a little whale i think it's cute so yeah you just kind of like pour water to keep it they basically just kind of keep it from keep you from like pouring water into their eyes so it has like a stream so that's what that is try this because a lot of people talked about this it's the tubby Todd hair and body wash the ointment all over ointment a lot of people swear by this ointment like um they said whenever the baby was born like they had a lot of like dry skin and when they put this on like it made their skin so moisturized um and this is the lotion so yeah all of this is like um all natural organic so i'm gonna be trying that and see how that works got some baby washcloths these are also um i want to say these are organic ones things are like bamboo hair like set thing oh that was really cute um the brush is like super super soft too not necessarily bath but i didn't know where to put it a nail clipper and then i have this uh thermometer it's actually a smart thermometer and it just keeps track of everything and it saves it onto your phone um, whenever you use it. So I thought that was pretty neat. And that is all that I have so far for that stuff. There are some other things I want to get, but that's what I have so far. I have is, I would say just like feeding. Um, I don't have, I'm not going to show you all the breastfeeding stuff because it's technically not really like for him. It's more like stuff that goes on me, I guess. But it's, um, okay, so I do have, a, a plan, like I said, I plan on breastfeeding. Um, I have the Boppy, uh, pillow, hold him, 
um, comfortably while you're trying to breastfeed. So that's what that's for. And they can also use this, I think, I think they also use this like the older they get. So like this can also be a longer as well. Like they kind of like sit up right here. Um, and then it could also be just like them like sitting up, like the older they get, they can sit up using it. Two little cute little bibs. They're like these little, they're super, super cute. There's like a bunch of them in this little thing. And it also came with some clips for him too. And on the lines of that, since I'm with that, um, this is some of the key, um, as far as I have, the clip is in there too. I guess I should show you all. I think I have I have it in the picture on my Instagram. But I'm just gonna show you. It's a really cute little wooden clip and the pacifier. It's the bibs one. I'm hoping that he takes the bibs ones. I really love the bibs um brand. But um if not, I'm gonna try a different one. And because I want John to have the same experience, because I'm going to be pretty much breastfeeding him all the time. Um, I found these bottles, and they're meant, like, the um, nipple part of it is actually supposed to still feel like, you know, breast. Like, it's supposed to still feel like mom's breast. Um, so, you know, it won't confuse them. And it's not going to be something I'm going to use all the time. I can't, like, breastfeed somewhere or whatever. I can help me do this. So, like, like, if I pumped and just put it in a bottle real quick... Um, or like I said, um, I wanted John to have the experience to be able to feed him sometimes. So that's what that is. Now I'm going to do transportation. I don't have his car seat yet, but we do have one that we are looking at. Like we most likely going to get, um, from Target. So, um, and then there's a stroller that I want to get as well. So I'm going to probably just post that on Instagram. So if y'all see that yeah it'll be posted on instagram um but this is his diaper bag just a on design bag and i love this because it's literally like a backpack because i don't like to wear purses at all and i didn't want anything like huge big and bulky so i thought this was perfect because this literally looks like the bag that i carry daily when i have to go somewhere i think this is literally the first thing i ordered this is a portable sound machine um so when he's trying to take a nap in the car um that way i have this in the car as well as in the house so he gets to have that same experience everywhere <laughs> this baby mirror so i can be able to see him i know for the most part i'll probably be in the back seat a lot if i happen to be in the front seat i can just spy on him real quick through his mirror i guess it's more like baby gear but transportation too because i mean he's gonna be i don't know i guess it's like baby gear transportation type thing whatever um this is the only baby wearing thing that i have right now um and i need to go back and look at the video again to see how to to wrap it around me because i was trying to practice on doing this but basically it's just a baby wearing uh wrap and this is from solly baby and i cannot wait to wear him around the house and just anywhere um i think it'd be really cute to have him wrapped on me and i don't have to like he could be right there and i can do all the things i need to do with him on me <laughs> um but i do plan on getting some more i want to get like a bunch of different colors that i have this is just like a few toys i don't have a lot of toys right now um there's like a few books on his little bookshelf right now but this is one of his little teething ring toys that i thought were really cute oh i lie i do have a um another little toy too and i want to say that's in one of my little instagram pictures little bunny uh teething ring thing which i thought was really cute and then oh my gosh i got him this i <laughs> thought this was really cute um because we're always talking about um he's gonna end up being like a little wrestler um, and I thought it was cute because it's like, um, it's almost like, you know, these toys is like he's going to go work out or something. So I thought that was really cute when he, when he showed me this. And I thought this was cute because it's literally like a little sweatband. That was really cute. Then the last section that I have is the like diaper. 
like diaper station. I have this gather mat. Um, when I'm gonna change him, um, I'm gonna use this thing because it is literally like this leathery material and um, it's so easy to clean. So like if I'm changing him and he pees, like it's just gonna go on here and it's like be a lot easier to clean up. Whereas if you're trying to change him on a rug or something or on the sofa without this, it'll go straight onto your sofa and then you have to try to clean it up maybe because it's gonna go right underneath him. And I only have one right now, but I'm definitely gonna be buying some more because I want to have at least one or two in here. And then I wanna have one in the bedroom and then one in the living room. And this is why I say this because when I get to this part, I got these little um, these little decorative basket things from Target. And basically what I'm gonna do is um, one of these are gonna go in the bedroom and then one of them is gonna be in the living room, like on the side of the sofa. Um, and basically it's just gonna have like, um, it's basically just gonna be a mini changing station. So they're gonna have one of these in there, a pack of wipes, diapers, um, it's gonna all be in there. Um, you know, you don't really have like a designated spot to change them. Like I feel like practical, like you're gonna be changing a baby wherever you're at because you wanna change them right away. So if I'm in the living room, literally can hurt and just grab these things real quick. It'll be right there on the side of the sofa. Grab these things and just change them right there. Um, if I'm in the bedroom, the same thing. It's there, which I'm gonna be in the bedroom like for the most part, because like that's where he's gonna be sleeping in, in the beginning for the most part. And I'll be probably laying down too. <laughs> um, and then in here, um, I won't have these things, but because they're gonna be in the dresser. That's why I'm gonna be making these stations, because I just feel like I'm gonna be changing him anywhere in this house. So, yeah. But that is pretty much it. Some other things that are gonna be coming in um, that is left on the registry. There's like not that much things left on the registry to be honest with you. Um, I'm very excited to continue working on the nursery so I can get the video out for that. And also I do have a hospital bag uh, video that's gonna be coming up real soon because I also have a few little things that I need to put in there that I don't have too. So, um, yes. Be on the lookout for a hospital bag video and a nursery tour. Yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Mm -hmm.